hit subscribe. And if you don't click subscribe, this invisible hamster will die. What's going on, YouTube? This your boy, Real Talk. You're now tuned in to Real Talk Media. We got something different to talk about today, boy. But before we get started, y'all know I got a real job too, right? I ain't just out here surfing the internet all day and running around catching bodies and shit all the time. You know, I do got to clock in at some point. With that being said, every blue moon, I might upload a video or a clip or something just so y'all get the info when I ain't got time to commentate. So if y'all ever see me upload a video and it do not got the audio on it like the other two did, make sure y'all comment and let me know. Oh, you supposed to check that before you upload it. Nigga, I ain't supposed to have a phone out at work. Fuck you mean. Anyway, I don't care if you a subscriber or you new to the channel or you just watch the videos from time to time. If the video ever don't got no audio on it, comment and let me know. With that being said, y'all already know how Rick Ross the rapper got his name, right? And if you don't, I'll give you a quick little tutorial, but I'm not going to go too deep into it. Rick Ross, the rapper, got his name from a alleged or accused former big time drug dealer named Rick Ross or Freeway Ricky, whatever y'all want to call him. Anyway, some of us may know that the Freeway Ricky or the drug dealer Rick Ross sued the rapper a while ago for stealing his name. Y'all should know the outcome of that. Anyway. Fuck all the little commentating stuff. We about to get right to this interview. Drug dealer Ricky clowning the other Rick Ross. Said he was like having a fangirl moment. Said the nigga, man, psh. Yo, let's get to this interview, bro. Of, 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 of Rick Ross. Right. And then what, do you think do you ever reach out to him? to like? Yeah, you know what I, I mean? I like, how was your flow? I hear in, in New Did York. I got one of my boys here in New York. He said, oh, he'll be in my office Monday at 9 o'clock. Oh, so you got to meet him. You met him. Talk. I talked to him on the phone, yeah. What was the vibe? He, he melted down. He had a meltdown. A meltdown? Absolutely. When you say meltdown, like he explained? Like a woman. Oh, hug, let me hear. Because he didn't know that I was going to be on the line. Okay. He Nobody just handed the phone. Oh, okay, now okay. he don't have his bodyguards at this time. Okay, okay, okay. He ain't, he ain't the guy you well, see today. But, 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 but is he, is he has one record out. He don't know what to do. Did he ever offer you something? Did, he, did like was there any was there ever friendly conversation well, with you? And him? How did happened. you how did this you approach him when you spoke to him? Let me tell you what happened in that conversation. Yeah, key. Okay. Oh, big homie, I love you. I owe you. Okay. Sounds good. When you gonna come see me, homie? When you gonna come to the prison so we can sit down face to face and talk? Uh, uh, send me the visiting form. I'm coming. What would you have been at that point? What would you been? What would you? What would you have been all right with? If, if that covers, how did you he want didn't that even have conversation? To give me no money. You wanted. You wanted him he to come to show you some respect. You wanted him to come and see you, and have the combo. What he could have did is just open doors for me. Okay. Show you. I could have took you his, the money. I could have took his career to places he ain't never thought about going. You took him to court for the name. Right. So is it that you wanted the name back? Oh, you want to be compensated no. for the name? I got out of prison. Uh -huh. I'm walking around, and a lawyer, a young lawyer, a young black lawyer walked up to me. He said, Universal owe you about $50 million. So before the lawyer came to you, this wasn't in your mind. You were, you were no, more like, let's do, let's, how can you I wasn't even thinking about him. I'm, I was like I am right now about him. He okay. don't even exist. But don't nobody bring his name up. He's okay. not even relevant in my world. But now, did you and him conversate again after that day? The, to uh, the time you got on the phone? He did. We did talk one time. I was in uh, Dallas. Uh, uh, did he come to see you? No, no, he, he didn't. Uh, Calix, somebody had put Calix on the phone. Okay. And Calix had invited me to a party that they was doing in Dallas at the All-Star Weekend. Okay. And then Calix turned around and he said, hey, Ross is right here. You want to speak to him? Okay. And he, he handed him the phone. We spoke. He said, Good combo? Wasn't, wasn't bad, you know. Mm -hmm. It's like, uh, we're going to be at the party. You want to come by the party? Did you go? No, I didn't want to go to the party. Okay. He had lied to me already. He changed his phone number. Okay, okay. When, when he never showed up to the prison. Okay. And, and then on top of I that, but then now, on top of that, be, I and then on leery. top of that, he did a little hating, too. I'd have been a little leery to show up to the prison. <laughs> Me, I would have been. Just in, just in general. He had worked in the prison, so why would he be leery of the prison? We didn't you know, know that know all yet. The, he, But I did. Oh, you, you knew that? I knew about the prison. I had letters from guys that was in prison with him. Okay, okay. He was shooting a video one time. Yes. Esther Baxter was in the video. Yes. Well, Exa Baxter used to write me every other day. She told me 
a holiday method video. When you say X device used to write you every other day, because I don't want to skip over that. What were you guys talking about, you and Esther? I'm just playing around with me, having fun. <laughs> she like she like drug dealers. <laughs> But not only You're her, writing I, each used other get, I used to get like 75 letters a week from women. Oh. Well. Want to marry me? Well, 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 well send this me is money. Okay. And how does that, I know that, did that case work out in your favor? Does no, I lost the case. Is, when you say lost, so nothing, he, he, has not, he didn't have to give you anything. But what were you asking for? Uh, I think we were asking Universal for $50 million. So you're asking for the money from Universal? Yeah, and then Ross, I think we wanted like 10 from him. You want 10 just to, for being mixed up in that? And then I saw him, we, we, we took his deposition in Arizona. I mean, in uh, uh, Miami. We flew down to Miami, we did his deposition. When you say we, you were in the room? Yeah, I was in the room. Oh, because you can be in the room during the deposition. I'm in the room when they do deps. Okay, and then you and him did not speak there, nothing? No, he rolled his eyes at me and, and you know, come in. And he tried to downplay me, you know, it's like... Um, it's just me and him. We're the only blacks in the room. Everybody else is white lawyers. Okay. Universal got about nine lawyers in the room. Universal fought hard. Okay. They didn't play. So you and him, there's no conversation there, nothing? No, I rest my hand out to shake his hand, and he snatched his hand back, you know, like, I don't want to touch you. Got you, got you. And, okay. uh, you know, I just said, okay, okay, buddy. So, mm. uh, you know, like right now, I'm getting ready to hit uh, FX and John Singleton over the head. I did hear... Rumor, I mean, before I, that, that it was about your life. I, that did hear that. Like, you know, when you're just bringing it up to I mean, people. who else, who else, who else in, in living right now? Mm -hmm. But now he not did. Only from, not only from L.A. If you took L.A. out of it, if you just said another black guy who was connected to the CIA, where's he at in the world? Because now, because Snowfall's base 85, 86. Now, are you still the, around in this time going hard? That's still my range. Okay. And did you, did you, did you talk you, to him you, about that, it? It don't matter if you change the time. The time don't really matter. It's, 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 it's what you say and, and, and what's going on in the story. And I haven't watched one, I haven't watched one episode. So, so but was, were you talking with John Singleton about doing a TV series or were you talking movie? Motion picture. So you can't still do the motion picture with John? I'm going to do the motion picture and the TV show. But you don't want to do My John. Funded. You don't want to. You Not John no more. We just hired Kim Harding to find us a director. So, so were you dis so you were disappointed in Snowfall because you feel pieces of it is your life. No, what I'm disappointed in is that a brother would sell out another brother mm -hmm. because I wouldn't sell my story to the white folks. When you say sell, what, they want to buy it from you. They want to buy my story. But what was your the offer? They offered me eight hundred fifty thousand. And then you have to, and then you don't make another penny off another of it. Another penny. I'd walk away. See, see where, where, where John messed up at is he changed my character. They just gave me some old lessons. I went and talked to, uh, uh, uh. When you say change the character in, in, in. It's called defamation of character. See, when I have the right to be who I am. Okay. Just like I am. Correct. You don't have the right to change who I am. Now, was he trying to change it in the script? It don't matter how you change it. Or, or do you feel like Snowfall changed your character? Snowfall changed my character. But how are you going to say, how, how are you proving without a doubt that that character is yours? Well, we can prove that certain things happen in Snowfall that hasn't happened to anybody else in the world. Wouldn't it be better to settle out on this one? Maybe, maybe he wants to meet up with you, John. Well, we talked we talk for a couple weeks, and then talks broke down, and... You know, I, I didn't tell him that, that the lawyers had already been knocking at my door, like, man, let me have him. Kind of like what happened with Ross. You know, they, let me have him, let me have him. <laughs> He's too bad. He's so funny. Wait. Okay, so then now, you're going to go to court, or, or you, you, you're open to settle? I don't know. Wow. I'm more expensive right now. <laughs> than last week. I, <laughs> way more expensive than I was last week. Why would anybody do a fake movie when you got the real guy and you know him? Well, it's a TV show. I'm like, but I'll but, tell you something. Why would I you still want your story. Like, that story. Flex. Why would you want to do a fake story first when you got the real? But I think there's room. I think that particular show is making me ten times more interested in what, in what you do. You know why? Because I wish I'm not the biggest Tupac fan. People know that I'm not. 
but I would have liked to have seen what a Tupac movie would have been with John Singleton at the helm. And Benny Boom, I love you, my brother. You know, I I just would have, because of their chemistry, because of their relationship. So when you tell me you and him sit and you talk and there's things going on, I do I do would like to see, because he's from L.A., correct? I don't know. I, th- I think he is. So I would. That, you know that, how guys say they from here and they from there and their name is this and, and <laughs> I don't never know. <laughs> But guess what he should have been thinking? If this dude was what everybody said he was, mm-hmm. let's build. He could just snap his finger, and whatever he wanted to happen in L.A. would have happened. But 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 I don't think. Cause you know what I've done. But I don't. But I don't. You know what I had to do. I don't think that's but, what he but look at this to, here. Look what I've had to do. But look what I've had to do, Flex. I've had to beg people. Please, don't go to the concert and do that. For well, me, and I, and for I me, listen, because, because to my you, know nephews, how, you know how that energy could go. To my nephews, look, nephew, don't do it. Let's keep it moving. No. Let it go. Unc wants you to do that for him. All right? I know you You the shot caller over there on East Coast Crip, but don't do that. That ain't what I want. I'm, I'm going to give you... John Singleton the same way. But, they, but, when he shot in South Central... Right, here. He shot in South Central. Let me tell you what they said. Not just the Crips, but a few brothers from the Nation of Islam. Mm-hmm. Say, man, let's go over there and stop him from shooting right now. I say, listen, man, that's a brother. You know, rap guys look up to the street. We're not saying. I'm not saying. You know, it, like I'm I, not he, saying that there's nothing wrong with him no, taking a name. But I mean, I think, I'm just I think he you, looked up I'm to what. I'm telling you that he took a name that already had value. Correct. I'd already yes, created, yes, yes, I'd yeah, already yeah, created yes, a absolutely. couple of million dollars okay. worth of value in the name. Absolutely, absolutely. I've been yes, on L.A. Yes, Times. Yes, when yes, those yes. cops went to trial, I was in the front page L.A. Times every single day. You know, he said that, this, this is what he said at his deposition. Okay. He said that he played football in Miami. Okay. Which he has no record of him playing football. Okay. There's no uniform, nowhere. You can't find a picture of him in a uniform. Okay. In a football uniform in, in, the, in the 90s and 2000s. No way possible you play football and there's not one picture of you in a, in a football uniform. You, so, gotcha. um, But he said he played football and somebody, the name of their line was the Big Easy. Mm-hmm. And somehow they started calling him the Big Boss and somebody accidentally said Rick Ross okay. instead of the Big Boss. And that's how he came up with my name. So, uh, uh, <clears throat> that was taking you a bad place. Huh? I was taking you to a funny place. No, no, it wasn't taking me. I was just... You, you wanted to know. Just did it happen or did it you. not happen? You wanted to know. How, how he denied the fact that he knew about me. Now, when I talked to him on that phone, when he was here in New York, because, you know, he was here in New York at one of my boys' offices. Gotcha, yeah, you changed your call. And uh, uh, he told me how he got the name. He said, man, I just... Some dudes from L.A. had came down, and they was talking about you, and I threw your name in a rap record, and... When I played the record for everybody, everybody's ears perked. Okay. And he said, I knew right then that that, that, that I was in love with you. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, 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 so that's how that came about. Um, but but in the beginning conversation, you felt like the respect was there in your first... No, no, no. It was a meltdown. Okay. <laughs> you said that... <laughs> it's a difference between respect and a meltdown. Okay. You know, a respect is... Uh, 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 when a person like, oh man, I'm glad to meet you. A meltdown is when, holy shit, where am I at? Whose office is this? Gotcha, gotcha. I don't even know where I'm at. I don't walk into a trap. Got you. Okay, I got you. I got you. And, and when you're in jail, one of the things that 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 I noticed about myself when I was in jail is we become really keen with the telephone. The, the energy. Oh, I can I can read energy off the phone because that's my favorite thing in the whole world. Gotcha. My whole, the most important thing to me in the whole day was to be on the telephone. So if I got on the phone with you, I could tell if you was having a bad day or not. <laughs> Yo, I mean, I like we'd agree with him on some aspects, but on other aspects, I disagree with him. Like for instance, I mean, if your name is Rick Ross. And somebody stole your name and got famous off of it and you still alive, so forth and so on. I'm not saying they gotta pay you, but I mean, come on now, bro. I mean, at least cut the nigga in on something. But as far as for the John Singleton jump, bro, 
how can you definitely say that them shows or that show and movie is about you? Like, what in it guarantees that they making some type of biography or autobiography or whatever you want to call it about your life? You really not giving us too much detail, but you could be saving that for court. So, hold on. I know some of y'all on here like, this nigga didn't upload a day whole interview. Oh, man. Why you upload day whole? Shut your crybaby ass up, nigga. <laughs> anyway... Drop a comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about this. I'm on Twitter now at Real Talk Blogs. I'm on what the fuck is the other thing? Oh yeah, Instagram. <laughs> Yo, I'm on Instagram at Real Talk Blogger. I'm tripping. I'm out.